this is the new MacBook. It's got a new awesome screen that's 12 inches that utilizes the screen real estate a lot better than the MacBook Air. As you recall, the MacBook Air actually has got those chunky borders on the edge there. But uh, yeah, 12 inch screen versus the 11.6. Um, I'm a big fan of the Air and the MacBook. But as you can see, very simple box here. Um, some of the newest technologies, new screen, the new trackpad is bigger than the MacBook Pro trackpad, which is just plain awesome. Uh, the keys are also bigger. Um, they're a little bit more flat in the keys. They are taking up quite a lot of the space on this new MacBook. So basically, it's utilizing all of its space efficiently. Um, the new speakers on this MacBook are just killer. They're better than the Air, and they're on par with the Pro. Uh, so I'll go ahead and open this up here. As you can see, pretty simple wrapping. Um, you'll also, you've probably heard that the new MacBook has the new trackpad technology, the Force Touch. Um, basically, it uses a little motor inside, so when you click, it vibrates. Um, the trackpad technology has been definitely improved. You can click anywhere now, not just on the very bottoms of the trackpad. So right now, um, actually in the past, Apple has had the best trackpads. Now they're even better. As you can see here, we have a little lip here, which we can pull up the MacBook. And uh, yeah, it's a nice all metal design this time. So very simple here. You just got those four little feet. And uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and uh, take it out here. There you go. Really nice looking. Put the uh, wrapping aside there. And so yeah, one of the first things you'll notice is the Apple logo now is uh, just reflective silver, just like on the iPhone and on the iPads. Um, the only connector here is the USB-C, which is for charging, it's for video, it's for everything. This is a universal connector. So this is a really interesting move to see that Apple actually did that because they've always had proprietary connectors that only they could use. Now you can use USB connector and uh, as more companies start adopting it, it's going to be really convenient to have. Also, there you saw the microphone and the uh, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Here on the sides, you're going to see the all metal body design, which is really nice because that used to be actually plastic. I'll go ahead and open that up and you see a little... Uh, white paper thing there keeping the screen protected no fingerprints or anything so yeah as you can see the trackpad in the in the keyboard are just utilizing the space fully and i absolutely love that i think that was a great idea the escape key is huge on the top left there um and all the keys are just bigger so they're bigger and uh yeah, and the MacBook just feels lighter. It's just it's just a really nice thing. All the things that we care about, they've pretty much upgraded on this new MacBook. It's got all the latest technologies. Um, it also has got the Core M processor, which isn't as powerful as some of the other ones like the MacBook Air and the MacBook Pro, but it's powerful enough to do video editing. It's powerful enough to do some light gaming like Team Fortress, Counter-Strike, Dota 2, League of Legends. So, I mean, you can play games on here if you like. Um, there's a big misconception out there that you can't video edit, that you can't play games, and that it's a slow machine. Not true. Check out my reviews, my more in-depth videos to talk about that. Um, we'll go ahead and power it on so you get your simple Apple logo. Anyway, here you have the box. Nothing special, guys. We've seen this before. Just a charger. Then you got your USB-C cable there on the bottom. And then you have your little pamphlets there that I just put off the side. Um, yeah, so with that new charger, it only accepts USB-C. And USB-C is on both ends now. So yeah, it's uh, it's weird because USB-C is a female connector, but it's also a male connector, which is really weird when you think about it. And you'll probably understand what I mean by that more when you uh, check out the connector itself. Because the connector, uh, it goes in like a male, but it also has um, a thing that goes in it when you plug something else in. So on the actual MacBook itself, there's a connector that sticks out like a prong that goes into the USB-C connector. So it's kind of like a weird hermaphrodite type connector, which is like male and female simultaneously. But uh, yeah, it's a pretty cool connector. It's really fast. It's the latest technologies. That's why Apple ado adopted it. And the awesome thing about it is that it's universal. And that's a first in Apple history, and I'm really impressed to be seeing that. So here's that little um, pamphlet box thing. Thank goodness Apple didn't put a bunch of stupid pamphlets we don't care about. You know, there, there are a few very simple ones. We used to toss those off to the side. The only real thing we care about is that awesome Apple stick or sticker there. Uh, you get two of them, which is cool. You know, whatever. Apple's been doing that for a very, very long time, and so we've kept it. 
If you guys have any questions about the device, go ahead, uh, ask below. I'll go ahead and answer those questions for you. Um, also, I did a review on the MacBook Air, which is pretty cool. You guys should check that out. Um, and I did a comparison of the MacBook, the MacBook Pro, and the MacBook Air all in one video, which was pretty cool. That took forever to make, but was really, I think it's a pretty cool video. Um, go ahead and uh, subscribe, please. Please subscribe. I need more subscribers. Uh, if I can't get enough subscribers, I, I might not be able to continue doing this any longer. And uh, if you can, like the videos. It really helps me out. Please. Uh, I really do appreciate you guys watching. And uh, yeah, provide me any feedback you can. I can make the videos better. Just just let me know if you have any tips or if you want to see a particular thing that you guys weren't seeing. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. See you later.